You know what happens after the error, right? It's an unwritten rule of baseball. Let's go. Oh, man, that's got to hurt. <laughs> that one's got to hurt. What is going on YouTube? Welcome back to another video. Today I have a very special video for you guys. I'm going to be doing a little collaboration with the one and only, the man himself, BC Reviews guys. Now, a lot of you probably know him already. If you guys don't know him, I'm gonna be dropping down his YouTube link and his Twitch as well. This is an amazing content creator. If you guys wanna be entertained, you gotta go hit up my man BC. Make sure to hit him up with a sub on YouTube and a follow on Twitch. Now, there's a question I've always asked myself. The Signature Series have always been the most overpowering cards in the game. Last year was Immortals, this year was Signature Series. Now my question is, can the finest cards be better than the Signature Series cards? Can they give them a run for their money? Now we're gonna put that to the test today and we're gonna be playing a full Finest Squad versus a full Signature Series uh, team. BC is gonna have the Signature Series, I'm gonna go with the Finest and we're gonna put it to the test. Now I'm gonna show you guys the squad I'm gonna be rolling with, so let's check it out. All right, so this is gonna be my team. We're gonna have Nolan Arenado at third base, Francisco Lindor at shortstop. He's gonna be making his debut. Javi Baez at second, Chris Bryant at first base. I definitely love that card, so I'm gonna play him at first. We're gonna have Christian Yelich making his debut in right field. Cody Bellinger, oh God, playing center field, man. That card is amazing. If you guys haven't tried it, I highly recommend you try him. Alex Bregman in left field. Now, I made a debut video for him. If you guys haven't already done so, make sure you check it out. He could play left field as one of his secondary. I think it's gonna be good enough to play left field. I honestly feel like his defense is gonna be good enough. So we're gonna test him out today and see if our theory is correct. For our rotation, we're gonna have Jacob DeGrom, Garrett Cole, Walker Bueller, Jack Flaherty, and Matthew Void. As far as bullpen, I don't have a full finest uh, bullpen squad honestly i don't even think they have more than three or four so we're going to be rolling with postseason cards replacing some of the finest that we don't have and i think it's going to be pretty even honestly as far as the bullpen goes they're not quite like finest cards but they're kind of like up there you know they definitely have uh better stats than the average live series so this is going to be our team guys now let's get to the game and here we go all right let's see who he has in the mount all right so he has tom siever on the mount he has Honus Wagner, Vladdy Guerrero, Ken Griffey Jr., Willie Mays, Eddie Murray, Edgar Martinez, Robbie Alomar, Brian McCann at catcher. And we're going to have Garrett Cole on the mound, so that's not bad for us. Now, th this is going to be interesting. This is going to be interesting. Let's see what we can do here. For baseball, 69 degrees Come on. Here first pitch. And we're going to get a little single up the middle to start this game off. All right, so that wasn't ideal. That, was, that wasn't a crazy hit, but I will take it. All right, Nolan, let's go yard here, buddy. Oh! Is that gone? See you later! Nolan hits the foul ball pull for a home run in the first inning. Let's go, baby. All right, fastball. Ah, we got under that. That was a good pitch. That, we should have done a little more with that. We got under you that. suck! Right, come on, show me what you got, buddy. Come on. You suck! Oh, my goodness. That was a terrible swing. I honestly, for some reason, I thought that wasn't going to be as inside as it was, but it was. that was not good. Come on. And we got under that with Yelich. Okay. We had a really good start with the first two batters, and then we completely sucked. All right, we did get two runs, though, in the first inning. I'll take that. All right, BC. I'm going to give you a smoke right here. Get this strike out. Oh, <laughs> we got him to pop up, though. I'll take it. I don't think he was ready for that. And he's going to get a hit on that. Oh, let's go. Belly's going to make the play. He's showing off that range already. Let's go, baby. The goal is to get out of this first inning without giving up a run. And we're going to do that. Okay. I will take it. Easy one, two, three to start off the game. I'll take it. All right, Bias. Come on, buddy. And right at him. Okay. I have no idea why that was such a bad pitch. All right, Brian. Come on, buddy. Oh, 
You suck! He's late on the fastball, so I'm gonna... I'm gonna see if he's early on this. Alright, we got him. He was actually late on that. I feel like all we need to do is hit a dot in the bottom. He's probably not gonna swing. He's gonna swing at that one. Oh, Cody. Oh, Cody. Cody oh, the huge. Let's go. And if you guys don't have Cody Bellinger, I highly recommend that you guys get him. Check this out. There's a strikeout right there. Never mind. Man, I want to get a pitcher home run so bad. Well, it ain't going to be today. You suck. Perennial MVP candidate, Francisco Lin. All right, we're gonna give him another knuckle curve here. Oh, that's a good one. That's a good. One. That's good. One. We gotta change that. There you go. We cannot be 0 for two with you, uh, with Belly right now. Come on. All right, lead off single. This is a good start. This is promising. All right, Bregman, come on, buddy. Oh you God. suck! How is everything a pop-up, man? We'll this That's insane. Down, man. That's the Everything's a pop-up. All right, Yelly. Come on. He singled his last yeah. time up. And he's gonna get a single up the middle. We might be able to stretch that. No, no, we gotta go back. That's that's Griffey in center field. We gotta go back. All right, runners in first and second. We only have one out, and we got Javi Baez at the plate. All right, two two count. Come on, buddy. And Baez is gonna ground out into a double. We're gonna make him pay for that. You know what happens after the error, right? It's an unwritten rule of baseball. Let's go. Oh, man, that's got to hurt. <laughs> that one's got to hurt. Let's go, baby. We need, we need to keep this going. You Another suck. pop up. All right, let's see if we can keep it going with Garrett Cole, man. Six scoreless innings. We're going to keep it going. All right. We got one. Bottom six. Guys, Cole is on fire right now. Get him! Yes! <laughs> Got him! Cole is dealing! And we're going to get out of this one. All right, six scoreless innings for my man Garrett Cole. All right, he brought it today, guys. He brought it today. Sometimes he does it. He brought it today. All right, we got top of the lineup. He's going to bring in Wade Davis. And Lindor's gonna get a leadoff. That's gonna be a double. I wanna say at least a double. Yeah, that's gonna be a leadoff double. Let's go, baby. That's her finally waking up. All right, we need Nolan to come through for us. Ah, he's gonna ground out to first base. That's gonna advance the runner, though. He's gonna intentionally walk belly. That's probably what I would have done, honestly. But he's gonna face Alex Bregman next. Ah, oh, we got under that. That should score the run, though. I will take it. That's going to give us another run. All right, Yelly, come on, buddy. And he's going to get another another single. Let's go. He's three for four so far. Christian Yelly's debut is looking pretty solid right now. Ah, oh, man. Another grounder to freaking shortstop. Baez is just not hitting for us today. All right, we got one more, though. Right, let's see if Garrett Cole can pitch seven scoreless. Oh, that's not a good start right there. That is not a good start for us. Lead off double for my man BC. He was sitting on that fastball for sure. Oh, can we get him at least at first? All right, we're going to get him at first. I can get my arms extended on. Probably won't come back inside for a third time. All right, he's going to score a run there. There's nothing we could have done, really. Maybe we could have played in, but, man, it's not worth it. Let's just get the out. And we're going to get him to pop up. All right. Hey, it's been a solid game by Garrett Cole, though. All right, Brian. Come on, buddy. And, oh, the shift is going to beat us on that one. All right. 
JT's gonna get a nice little single up the middle. I will take it. Let's go, baby. One out single. All right, guys. Rookie of the year, Jordan Alvarez. Cuban power. About to do some damage. Come on, man. Go yard. And we pop it up because that's what we love to do. All right, another pop up. Nothing new. You guys are used to it by now. Top of the lineup again. And oh, Lindor! We needed a home run to complete the cycle with Lindor. Oh, warning track power, not quite enough. All right, bottom ninth. He has top of the lineup coming up. Come on, Zach. Oh. And we're gonna get him to pop up to right field. I will take it. We got one. All right, we're gonna bring in Liam Hendricks, finest 99, to face Vladdy Guerrero here. And oh, Lindor with the play and shortstop, and he got him. Let's go. That is that gold glove defense at shortstop from my man Lindor, man. We got two outs. This is it. Bottom of the ninth. Oh, that's gone. Oh, can we rob this? Can we rob this? Let's go. We didn't need to rob it, but um, we, we were able to make the play. All right, so player of the game, obviously, is going to be Garrett Cole. He had those seven strong innings pitched, three hits, seven strikeouts, only one run earned. That was a really solid performance by my man Garrett Cole. Francisco Lindor went three for five, triple, double, two runs. He was one home run away from the cycle, and he was honestly so close. He had a, uh, that last at bat, he had a warning track shot. Could have gone either way, but it is what it is. All right, guys, that is going to be it for this video. Now, if you guys enjoyed the video, make sure to hit that thumbs up button. Let me know in the comment section what you guys think. If you guys think the finest cards are better than the signature series. Honestly, I feel like they give them a run for their money. I feel like you can play ranked seasons and go to World Series with finest cards. I feel like you can have a stud squad. I actually have some of the cards from finest that are actually in my current ranked season squad. So... Again, if you guys like this video, hit that thumbs up. Make sure you guys follow my man BC. His YouTube is going to be down in the description below. His Twitch as well. Guys, I appreciate it. I'll catch you guys next time.